What's up guys? In this tutorial, I will show you how to fix the problem when shift lock is not working in Roblox on your PC. To begin, open Roblox and load into any experience. When the game client starts, it might verify your Roblox installation or check for updates. Let it complete the process, as this ensures everything is up to date and running smoothly. Once you're inside the game, press the escape key on your keyboard. This opens the in-game settings menu. Alternatively, you can click the Roblox icon in the top left corner of the screen to access the same menu. In the settings menu, focus on the following three options that directly impact the functionality of shift lock. Shift lock switch. Look for this setting in the menu and ensure it's toggled on. Shift lock allows you to toggle between third person and first person perspectives by pressing the shift key, but it only works if the setting is enabled. If it's already on, toggle it off and back on again to ensure the change is applied. Camera mode. Set the camera mode option to default classic. This mode is the standard Roblox camera setup and it ensures compatibility with shift lock. If your camera mode is set to something else, like follow or first person, shift lock may not function properly. Change it to default classic and proceed to the next step. Movement mode. Verify that the movement mode is set to keyboard and mouse. This ensures Roblox is optimized for PC controls and recognizes input from your keyboard and mouse. If this option is set to anything else, such as click to move, shift lock might not respond when toggled. After adjusting these three settings, click the resume button to return to the game. At this point, you should be able to press the shift key to toggle shift lock on and off. If these steps don't resolve the issue, Consider restarting Roblox or checking for updates to ensure your client is running the latest version. You can also verify that your keyboard is functioning correctly and that the shift key is not physically damaged. I hope this helped you out. Leave a comment if you have any questions and see you in the next one.